Today I want to talk to you about the TS200Q. The TS200Q is the top of the line machine in the TS series for Janome. And the reason it's the top of the line is loaded out with stitches, it's loaded out with features, and it's loaded out with bonus accessories that is going to meet most people's sewing needs. Another thing about the Janome machine is the way the uh, ankle is made on it here, which you snap your on and off your presser feet. There's all kind of optional accessories that are available for the machine. Ken Sewing Center carries everything that's made for this machine. So let me give you a brief overview of the machine and, and show you what all of this machine can do for you. The main stitch functions on the machine uh, of the TS200 will allow you to do quite a bit. First of all, because it is a top of the line machine, you're going to get some of the best quality that's on the market by far. And it's so easy to operate this machine. All your buttons are laid out right here in front of you. Uh, here I can adjust the stitch selection. It will come with a huge stitch pattern card that will show me on screen what number corresponds to what stitch. And we'll go through the number of stitches with you in just a few minutes. Here I can regulate the width of the machine. And here I can adjust the stitch length on all of my sewing patterns. Another thing that Janome does, the way this computer board is laid out, because there are so many stitches on the machine, they split the machine up in categories. So if I just want to do a buttonhole, I can go right there. It fast forward through the stitch count to the buttonholes, and then I'm able to pull up my different styles of one-step buttonholes. Same way with my utility zigzag or straight stitch. Because this machine will have an alphabet font built in, I do have upper and lower case on my alphabets and it does have uh, numbers as well. I can memorize, so if I want to type a name, a monogram, or whatever, I'm able to do that. And the monograms will be about a quarter of an inch tall, because this machine does an, a seven millimeter width on, on our stitch. Also on the machine, I do have a speed control that I can override my foot control and slow the machine down. So if I'm working with a very expensive piece of material, or if I'm a beginner, or if I just don't want to make a mistake, I can slow it down so I'm not going too fast and speed it up uh, for other applications. It does have the needle up, needle down feature here, so I can set my machine to stop needle in the fabric for my applique work or turning corners. That's very nice to have. But also for beginners, uh, or just so I don't forget, I can have the machine stop out of fabric, so I never have to worry about jerking a hole in my fabric or breaking a needle. That's uh, a really, really nice feature to have does have the auto lock feature here. This will tie the stitch off underneath for me. Though I do have reverse, you will probably use this more, more often than reverse because it ties the stitch off underneath for us. The back tag is not shown. It's all hidden underneath and the top of my garment and the stitch quality is going to imp be improved quite a bit. It will have a start stop button on the machine. Start stop is nice to have because now if I don't want to use my foot control, I don't have to. I just hit start to begin and start to finish. It does have the built-in needle threader on the machine that threads that uh, eye of the needle for me. Now I'm going to show you just how easy it is to thread the machine and show you a few of the sewing applications that the machine can do. TS200Q is really easy to thread. You have a horizontal spool pin. It also will come with a vertical spool pin, so if I want to do twin needle sewing, I can do that. On the machine here, everything is channeled all the way down to my needle. There's plenty of thread guys to keep the threads where they need to be and then of course I have that needle threader built in. So as I thread the machine to show you everything, I just go right down the channel, go behind my guides here, this guide here, and then I can just pull my needle threader down. And I've threaded the eye of that needle. Our bobbin case is going to be just as easy to thread. Everything is channeled on the bobbin case. There's really just one place I have to put my, my thread in, and now I have thread that. The TS200Q does have the top drop-in bobbin, and that's really nice to have because now I can see my bobbin. I can see how much thread I have on it. The uh, rotary hook system of the TS200Q is going to be a smoother operating system. If I get to the side seam on a pair of pants or heavier sewing, it's going to make it the le uh, less likelihood of the machine jamming up on me. You'll find on the TS200Q, there's plenty of stitches and features on this machine. And for the price that we have it uh, listed at on the website, you'll find it's an excellent value. We'll have a large enough motor that can handle heavier quilting and sewing. 
And on this particular machine, there are some bonus accessories that you will be getting when you make your purchase. We are including the quilting kit, and in the quilting kit, I have the built-in uh, has the walking foot. We'll have the adjustable seam guide that I can make um, decorative rows of top stitching with. I have the open toe uh, foot. I have the quarter inch seam guide foot. This machine on the throat plate, I have a place that I can actually screw in a seam guide. And this is an all metal seam guide that is being included so I can measure off from my needle a certain seam allowance. Tighten this down into the bed of the machine so it's not going to move. And I have this huge guide here that's going to help me keep my fabric straight. And then you have the free motion stippling foot. You can use this for free motion quilting, free motion embroidery, or if I need to darn a hole on a piece of material. Also, we're going to, you're going to be included the big quilting table. This table is made to fit this particular machine. I just slide the accessory tray off. We'll get the one step buttonhole foot that will come with the machine. And then I'm able just to slide this right onto the machine. Now I have plenty of uh, support for larger garments like quilting, drapes, dresses, shirts, so on and so forth. And I'm not having to wrestle at my needle with that fabric. It's going to make it a lot easier for me to sew. Now I'm going to show you just a little bit of just how durable this machine is and what all you can do with it. Probably the heaviest thing that you're going to be sewing on this machine would be maybe hemming pants or doing garment grade leather. The machine can handle it just fine because the motor size is, is plenty large enough. You have good quality working parts on the machine. But here I have eight ply denim and that basically represents the side seam on a pair of pants. Uh, the machine that ha itself will have uh, really nice tension system. It's, you're not going to have to adjust tensions that often on the machine. I'd be very surprised if you ever do. But this one basically represents about as thick as I'll be sewing. And then also, I have extra high lift under the presser foot. So I can put my garment underneath those thicker materials, and then I'm ready to go. So I'm going to show you extremely thick material down to some of the stretchiest material, and it's going to be able to handle that just fine. Notice how it crawls down the material just fine. Going right to my next piece of material, which is a standard size, standard weight cotton. And then this is some stretching material that I'm working with here. And you're going to notice this machine is not going to pucker it. I'm going to hit my auto lock button and tie the stitch off underneath for me. And the machine will stop when it's finished and doing the tie off. And I have a little thread cutter on the side of the machine. And I've went from extreme heavy to light to a stretch material. The TS200Q is loaded out with plenty of stitches. We do have a full stitch placard on the website and hopefully you can see from the stitches I have here that I've got different, uh, I've got one step buttonholes here, I have my regular utility stitches, straight stitch, zigzag, uh, overcasting, I'll have some blind hem stitches here. On my one step buttonholes, it will come with the special one step buttonhole attachment that I can size the buttons every time to whatever style that I dial up here on the screen. I will have different applique stitches for quilting, giving a garment a vintage look. You can play with this and adjust the stitch length and the width on these tacks. I will have some heirloom stitches that are built in on the machine. Get you a wing needle, and put in there it makes the really large hole in the garment with this particular heirloom stitch. It really is pretty how it'll come out for little girls dresses and napkins and things of that nature. Down here I will have uh, some more quilting and then I get into some of my decorative stitches down here. The machine does have uh, the built-in alphabet font that I can do the upper and lower case and punctuations. And then on the back side I will have also another mode here that has even more decorative, the old-timey feather stitches here. Uh, I get down in some other decorative stitches and I can adjust my length and width settings so I can play with and make these stitches look thicker. And play with that, I can also memorize these stitches so if I want to do a decorative border with, say, these hearts here, I can do the, that and keep adding and make a particular design on the garment. So as I keep going down, and you can use these 
for doing uh, quilt tops and stippling in the quilt tops and making these designs uh, doing di different widths apart uh, using that walking foot and using your seam guide and it really does make a difference as the appearance onto the garment so because the machine will have so many stitches and having the ability to combine those you can do a lot more with this machine than the average machine Ken Sewing Center is an authorized dealer for Genomi we are a full service center uh, at our store we have four full-time technicians we're open six days a week so any machine that you purchase from us if you have a question on how to operate it if you have a question you think maybe I'm having a repair issue or some of this doesn't look right or I need help with an accessory we have plenty of people several educators that can help you several salespeople that can help you with any question you may have and that's free of charge for any machine that you purchase from us so do not hesitate to give us a call uh, with any questions you may have about this machine or any other maybe you have a certain feature you're needing uh, for on a machine just give us a call we can give you a list of machines and compare them for you and find the machine that's going to be right for you